welcome back guys to another video and in this video we'll be seeing how windows 10 performs on the jaguar board now a lot of you were actually uh, criticizing how uh, windows 10 won't really work that well on just one gig of ram uh, but actually it does and we'll talk about it more uh, further into the video so let's go ahead and boot uh, windows on the jaguar board from the point uh, when you see the intel logo it takes around 15 seconds for the windows to boot completely which uh, is really great especially for something like uh, an intel atom with just one gig of ram so let's go ahead and log into our uh, windows de desktop and here we can see we do have a full fledged uh, windows installation let's go ahead and open up google chrome uh, and let's see what all we can do and what all we can browse so i'll go ahead and open up my channel and uh, let you guys have a look at how the video playback is so as you can see the ads are stuttering a little bit but uh, once the system has settled down uh, the video playback gets actually a lot smoother and yeah, it does handle 1080p with uh, no problem so i'll just go ahead and open up system monitor or task manager if you may and i'll keep that on the other side So as you can see uh, one, uh, when the system is actually uh, just booted it does take 100% uh, CPU utilization and even the memory utilization is very high considering uh, this board has only 1 gig of RAM. So let's go ahead and uh, play this video for a while and then we'll see. Uh, how the Jaguar board is performing of course Google Chrome is no light browser it's it's pretty RAM heavy it's pretty CPU intensive but uh, if you are just using uh, Google Chrome uh, it won't be any issue now of course I'll go ahead and also open up real temp to check on the CPU temperatures now do keep in mind it's all passively cooled there is no fan on it there's just one uh, simple heat sink and according to me that is doing a pretty nice job at uh, full CPU utilization we are seeing temperatures uh, in the neighborhood of 50 degrees Celsius which is really nice Alright, so as you can see the system has kind of settled down, uh, the CPU usage has gone down by uh, a margin and so has the memory usage. Uh, at this point the video playback should be very smooth uh, and we will continue our testing uh, and let's see what else we can do. So I'll open up another tab and I will... Uh, go to the Jaguar board's own website So as you can see Google Chrome is very responsive. There's no uh, lag as such or uh, there's no uh, hint of it uh, being it stressing out the hardware So I'll just show you uh, the specs uh, what as windows sees it and i'll just go to the system properties and as you can guys as you guys can see it is a 32 bit operating system and has 1 gig of ram because the 64 bit operating system requires uh, 2 gigs of ram we are not able to run that uh, on the jaguar board so it's 32 bit for now uh, and that really doesn't make much of a difference but it's, uh, it's it works really well so that's that 
uh, I'll also go ahead and open up my own website so that's geektillithurts.com uh, it's not heavy but it's uh, fairly animation intensive uh, especially once you first open the web page so it kind of uh, so as you can see it's really uh, working very smooth and let's go ahead and open up uh, another tab and i will open up something called hello racer now that is a webgl uh, application a webgl demo uh, now what a webgl actually uses your hardware gpu to render the 3d graphics on your browser so it will take a little bit time to load at as it usually does uh, but i think it should work really well uh, let's go back to the jaguar boards website for now uh, and also let's see how the video is doing so as you guys can see it's playing back pretty smooth uh, no issues there uh, okay so the webgl has done loading up so as you can see everything is really smooth the 3d rendering is going on pretty well so for basic 3d applications and basic uh, web browsing and all of that stuff and if you really really need to uh, do everything on windows uh, this is a good option of course it will really uh, it will run microsoft office really well uh, i had no installation media uh, also another thing about uh, the java board is that the internal memory is quite limiting uh, if uh, consider if uh, we consider installing windows on it so at this point the internal memory on the jaguar board that i have left uh, available for use is just 1.2 gigabytes which is not really that much and i don't even think office uh, something like office will install uh, easily uh, but saying that windows actually performed way way better than i ex expected uh, way better than every, anyone expected way better than my father expected he actually didn't even realize that uh, uh, the jaguar board was running windows and he uh, just to test that it was actually running windows he just unplugged the hdmi cable while it was running so yes the jaguar board was running is running windows successfully no issues windows 10 all the way uh, one last thing the whole reboot process just takes around 40 seconds it's, it takes under 40 seconds and this is it for the video uh, really nice board uh, you can really uh, you can run windows on it which is really nice for some people and that is about it thank you so much for watching this video guys uh, do subscribe and i'll keep you updated on further uh, investigation on the jaguar board Thanks for watching and I will see you guys next time.